barley salad tonight with Manitoba Crop Alliance and Jessica Penner. Um, you always bring very nutritious, you are a dietitian, you bring these really uh, incredibly um, nutritious recipes, but also we've got so many textures. This looks so promising, lots of colors, and I can't mm. wait to see what we're going to do with this. So uh, let's get started. Yes, let's start by showing everybody how to cook the barley. Yes, please. So yeah. anytime that you might be working with an ingredient that le is less familiar to you, it can feel intimidating. So let's just break it down step by step. Yeah, let's not, let's de-intimidate it for you. It's not a word, but it is now. Okay, <laughs> so how do we, uh, it's, it seems pretty simple. simple. You kind of have a little sort of code for it. Yes, you're yeah. going to start like rice, finish like pasta. Okay. So just like rice, you'll add the barley mm -hmm. and the water to a pot. It's not like you have to boil the water first, first. you boil it with the barley yeah. already. Okay. All together. Mm -hmm. And so you'll bring it to a boil. And what's the ratio? Yeah. Do you know off the top of your head, barley yeah. versus? Three to one. Three to one. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now the barley is going to get really nice and big. Okay. Yeah. So then you bring that to a boil. Then down to a simmer, mm -hmm. and then cook until tender. If you're cooking pot barley, that'll be about 40 minutes. Okay. Pearl, 25. Okay. So either one works for this recipe. All right, and this is pot barley we're using tonight, right? Or, yes. Yeah, okay. And then once it's cooked, then you're going to drain like pasta. Oh, and rinse as and well? And rinse, yeah. Okay, because it has to be, yeah. well, not has yeah. to be cold, but it's... Yeah, it well, for can... this recipe, it should be cold. We don't want to cook our nice, fresh vegetables. Yeah, okay. So if you are making this all in one go, you can cool it by adding that cold water through. Okay. If not, you could make this a two-day two affair. Cook the barley one day, cool it in the fridge, and then assemble the next day. Can you freeze cook barley? You can. Okay, yeah. that's mm -hmm. good to know also. And so, mm -hmm. so high in nutrients, so nutrient dense barley is. Yeah. Yes. So, okay, so we've got that cooking um, mm -hmm. or will be cooking. And so yes. now we're gonna move on to our dressing. Is that what we're yes. doing? Okay. Yeah, it's incredibly simple. We're just gonna dump everything in and whisk it together. Am I doing this? Yes, please do okay. the honors. We okay. have canola oil. Okay, number one. one. Okay. Mm -hmm. What we else? have our plain yogurt. Right. Yeah, is this, I can help you too. Thank you. This is just, um, is it Greek yogurt or just any Either kind of plain? Either one works. Okay. Yeah, nice. plain, nice, Greek. Nice, nice. Okay. A little bit of lemon juice. All the salt goes in here? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll pass the honey to you. Oh, yes. Okay. And then we have our curry, of course. Mm -hmm. Some yeah. It's right in the, t in the name, so it's yeah. got, <laughs> got to have that. Turmeric for a little extra of the Ooh, color. Yeah. And garlic. Okay, awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, so then we kind of smush all that together. Just the highly technical it all term. Together. Okay. You should be the food expert. You got the words. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't think so. Um, yeah, so nice color. Um, mm -hmm. And, you know, ag again, like really nothing too complicated in there as far as like no. uh, the, the ingredients that you would use for this. Yeah, right? really basic ingredients that you'll find at your local grocery store. But it also, I think with a recipe like this, it's got to be kind of like um, just lots of flavor, right? Because it's got mm -hmm. barley is kind of, um, you know, it's the heart, it's hearty, right? So you got to have something that's going to get in there and, and really yeah. stick. So, okay, yeah. so that's the dressing. And the barley is great. It really soaks up all that flavor. Mm -hmm. Did you know? Barley is a great source of beta-glucan, a type of soluble fiber that can help lower cholesterol. Only one cup of cooked barley each day is needed to reach the therapeutic dose. So here we have our cooked and cooled, cooled. barley. Yeah, and the boy, uh, does it ever get, it pops it gets big, I cooked yeah. barley a lot, so. so we add that to our salad. Okay. And then the vegetables, of course. We mm. have shredded carrots, okay. sliced celery. Okay, I see and a few dates things here. for yes. a nice little sweet and salty kick. Anytime, mm. yeah. Love adding dates to everything. <clears throat> parsley. Okay. I've used the curly parsley, but you could also use flat leaf if you have that. Okay. And then sunflower seeds. Oh boy. So, Fun fact about sunflower seeds, you'll see them grown in abundance here in Manitoba, sure. but they are actually a native species to the prairies. That I did not know, mm -hmm. and so that's very cool. Mm -hmm. um, and then our dressing, we'll just dump it on top. Okay, do we yeah. want to do that? Do we have something <laughs> to, uh, let's, why don't we bring mm -hmm. this guy back here? Okay, so, ho oh, ho, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> that was really fun. This is kind of awkward here. Okay, there we go. All right. 
So there you have it. And I, I, so now, is it one of these salads where can you let it sort of sit and would it be better than it's day? Definitely. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Because sometimes I've, it can get like soggy too, but maybe that, but because it's barley, no. maybe it holds up pretty well. Yeah, it yeah. definitely holds up in the fridge. I, Look at that. I've made this. Um, not for a crowd, just for myself. Yeah, yeah. And I've eaten it all week. And yeah. So definitely holds up well. Did you want to try some today? I would absolutely okay. love to try some. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. So as you can see, mm -hmm. it does make a large amount. Mm -hmm. And if you are not going to a potluck, I've made this so that you can mm. easily cut the ingredient list in half and just make half a recipe. So mm -hmm. the sweet in the, in the dressing mm -hmm. and, um, oh, like, Whoa, <laughs> there's so much going on there and it's absolutely scrumptious. You absolutely have to try this. Can I say absolutely one more time? Like it's just so, so good. Um, there you have it. This is salad number one, meal worthy salads tonight. When we come back, we're gonna do balsamic fig and barley grain bowl with crunchy seeds. Don't go anywhere here on Great Taste. We'll be right back.